Time right now to meet up with Anthony J in the Weather Center and uh, get a look at what our forecast is going to be after actually a pretty nice weekend. Anthony, good morning. Marshall, hello. Good morning. Yes, great to be back. How was yours, your weekend? Uh, it was nice. Uh, we had a nice weekend around here. Nice weather. We had a lot of events go on. Uh, and uh, it was, I would, if the weather could be graded on a 10 as being the best, I'll say for the whole weekend, uh, Friday through Sunday, probably a 9.75. Oh, yes. Yeah. yeah, this time of year we get some nice stretches of dry weather. Uh, might see a little interruption uh, later today. Uh, so, but it's nice out there. It's warm though. Uh, our normal highs now are down about in the low seventies, but, um, we're going to top out about 85 this afternoon and still a little bit muggy at times. Uh, I'll expect some showers and thunderstorms to develop and move by, by mid afternoon at well after lunch and then, uh, into this evening. So I don't think anything severe, uh, maybe a gusty wind or two, and some lightning, and some rain for the plants and the lawns. And then we're back to September, dry September weather for Tuesday, Wednesday. Uh, cooler tomorrow. It'll feel better tomorrow, low 70s. And then uh, the next chance of any shower is probably not maybe on Thursday. Otherwise, it's a dry week, so no major problems. Um, I'm still watching the tropics. Uh, it's actually been active. Uh, but nothing that's been too bothersome since, you know, old Dorian there. Uh, there's Tropical Storm Jerry in the middle of the Atlantic. It's going to stay out there. And Tropical Storm Karen, which is down in the Eastern Caribbean, thankfully it's not strengthening. Uh, we hope it just sort of like fizzles out uh, over the Caribbean. But well, we're going to watch it. It might drift north of Puerto Rico in a few days, but not expected to strengthen much. So that's some good news. We're still in hurricane season, so we're that's why we're... Keeping an eye on things. It was beautiful weather to take a look at uh, the space station go overhead this weekend. It was oh, perfect. Oh, yes. Did, perf you have, did you happen to catch it? Uh, no, but I saw pictures of people that actually did, and I saw it. it was. They said it was very, 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 very uh, uh, distinct. So it flew. It had a path that was just about right over the northwest corner of Connecticut. So if you, oh. were, if you were out and it was that dark, you got to see it glowing in the sky. Yeah, that's a that's a treat for sure, and we're gonna have those uh, clear skies, clear mornings uh, for the next uh, several days. Uh, I don't I don't see any uh, real cool weather headed our way anytime real soon. So uh, enjoy the uh, mild to warm temps, you know, for the rest of the month. Really, it looks like um, until we, uh, you know, head close. Uh, well, about a month from now, uh, it'll be Halloween. Which is one of my favorite holidays. No, are you, are you all set up with what 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 you're going out as? Oh uh, no, I had a couple. I have a couple of ideas, but the one thing I love about being in New York City is um, it's really fun here around Halloween time, like in the village, when everybody's dressed up and it's just a real, you know, ener energetic, uh, really fun atmosphere. NYC, you don't even have to go out to look like Halloween in New York City. Yeah, yeah, they have a Halloween parade down here. Uh, that's a tradition that continues. Uh, so that's uh, that's something uh, to look forward to, I'd say. All right. Well, as long as the weather's there, you're absolutely right. I just hate it that it's uh, getting it's darker now. It's pitch black when I come in in the morning, and it's getting darker earlier and earlier in the afternoon and the evening. So that's <laughs> the depressing part of this uh, this whole thing. All right. Well, I guess we'll speak to you in one week's time. Will do for a couple more weeks. Yep. All right. Take care, Anthony. Thanks, Marshall. Bye-bye. Uh, that is, uh, of course, Anthony J. in the Weather Center for Pat Pagano this morning here on The Breakfast Club on Robin Hood Radio.